Yes, everything has been cleaned and washed. This is the chives. This is the onions. And I've washed and cleaned the yellow squash. These are the peppers. They can be in one plate, the red, the orange, and the yellow pepper. And I have two tablespoons of seasoning. You know, depending, I might not use it all. So, and then the pepper, you know, depending on your taste, you can make it spicy or little spicy. So, that depends on how you want it and your taste. So, all these ingredients, I'll be using them in a little while. And you'll see how I do it. Okay? I have just a little bit of extra virgin olive oil you see how little i have it just a little bit you don't need a lot for this sauteed yellow squash just a little bit of olive vegetable oil you put it to medium heat and you add the onion You add the onion, allow it to heat a little bit. Allow the onion to cook a little bit. Then I put the salt, a little bit of salt. Since the onion has cooked a little bit, you add all your yellow pepper, orange pepper, and then the red pepper. You add them all in the mix. You stir, still living at the yellow heat, and then you cook it for a little while. See, there's little or no oil in it, just a little bit of virgin oil. Then you cook it at still at medium heat. Okay. Allow it to cook for a little bit. I'm gonna cover it up. Now let me look at it. I'm gonna cover it up to simmer for a couple of minutes before we add other ingredients. Okay. It has simmered for a minute. It has simmered for a minute. I'm gonna add some seasoning. And then pepper. Seasoning and pepper. Okay. It looks absolutely good. Now, I think I'll be adding, I'll be adding the yellow squash. The 
depending on the quantity you're eating or cooking. I like cooking a lot. So I love really squash. This is the yellow squash is added. Now you're gonna turn, you're gonna stir it. So that the seasoning Can add a little bit more seasoning. If you want, you can add a little bit more of the pepper. I, can, I will taste it in a little while to find out if the pepper, if I need more pepper. Normally, I like my food spicy. I will allow this to cook a little bit, okay? Wow, it's almost done. It's been 15 minutes. So, this is almost done. So, lastly, I add the chives. You stir. You see how beautiful it looks. I will allow it to simmer for five minutes. Okay. Almost ready. So I'll allow this to simmer for five minutes. And I'll get you guys. Okay, this is done. The yellow uh, squash is done. The salted yellow squash. So I'm gonna turn off the light. And you can eat this with anything. You can eat this with rice, with um, beans, with potatoes. But um, I think I will eat mine with baked potatoes and rice cauliflower. Okay. So that's it. It's delicious. And I will show you guys. Okay. Yes, lunch is ready. I'll be eating my yellow squash. Wait. Baked sweet potato and salmon. You can eat this by itself if you want, but uh, I want to eat mine with baked sweet potato and uh, some. I think that's enough. That should be enough for me. Okay. 
so this will be my lunch hi everyone lunch is ready and what do i have in my plate i have grilled grilled sal salmon fish i have baked sweet potatoes and i have sauteed yellow squash okay let me taste it mm -mm -mm. so delicious let me try the salty yellow squash mm. Mm -mm -mm. absolutely delicious this salted yellow squash you can eat it with anything rice beans rice cauliflower initially i wanted to eat it with rice cauliflower but i think it's a little bit too much so just a sweet potato can do okay with a salmon like i said when you're watching your weight the key is the portion i don't want the portion to be too much so just the um sweet potato the salmon and this that's enough okay they all taste delicious and i showed you guys how to cook this um yellow squash the salty yellow squash it's it's this tastes delicious you can try it i showed you guys how to cook it it's delicious I showed you guys how to make this salted yellow squash. It tastes awesome. Okay. All right. I'll see you guys next time. Let me eat up. Have a wonderful day. Stay blessed. That's a close-up.